General Motors has been quietly servicing Tesla vehicles. As customers of the EV maker are frustrated with Tesla's complex repair network, there you see shares of Tesla continuing to fall down more than a percent, and GM up one. Yahoo Finance Senior Autos reporter Praz Subramanian here with more on this. Praz, there's long been discussion about the, the network of dealerships that GM and Ford have. Would that be an advantage or disadvantage? Maybe we're getting a glimpse here. Not just for GM owners, right? It's for <laughs> an, an, an advantage for Tesla owners. So, you know, we're seeing that last week at the investor meeting, uh, GM President Mark Royce said they had serviced 11,000 Teslas in the last year wow. at GM service centers. So, this is kind of speaking to a pain point of Tesla ownership is that there aren't that many service centers to begin with, let alone in, there's not, uh, in every state doesn't have one, right? So, right. if you're out of state, you got to take it somewhere else. And, and GM supposedly has within 10 miles of a dealer, and there's 90% of the U.S. population within 10 miles of, the US, of a GM dealer, so it makes a lot of sense. So if you're a, a, an EV, uh, considering an EV purchase, would you consider an, uh, a GM product over a Tesla product just based on service alone? Maybe you would, but this is the thing that, this is something that GM really wanted to crow about, and they, and they did. And uh, what are some of the other options that uh, Tesla owners may have if they own a Tesla and they're looking for servicing and maybe uh, the head honcho just can't do it at that exact moment? <laughs> well, you know, you don't really have that many options, right? They have, they have Tesla mobile service where they actually send a person out with the van, they can fix you up there, but that's only in certain situations. In California, you have a lot of third-party Tesla EV operators because there's so many EV cars there, but for the most part, if you're in a, in a, in a middle America state, you really are kind of at the whim, uh, whims of, of a Musk and company and how they're going to service you, or you're going to a GM dealer. And this, Praz, is why I'm so bullish on GM and Ford now that they've turned their attention to the EV space. Going to be interesting to watch how Tesla fights back. Yeah, Praz, thank you.